Good morning, guys. It's Kim again. Um, I hope everybody had a wonderful holiday weekend. Um, mine was short, sweet, and quiet. That's what I like. So, um, didn't do too much. Uh, just kind of hung around. Uh, the significant other, um, he actually had to work on Monday, so we didn't really do a whole lot. And um, now I'm back talk talking to you guys. Um, what I wanted to talk to you guys today about, um, I want to talk to you about happiness and how we achieve happiness. I actually have 10 ways that we as humans can make ourselves more happy. The first way that we can make ourselves happy is exercise. Exercising, not every day, maybe every other day, um, about seven minutes a day, that would actually increase your endorphins in your brain. It will improve your mood as well. So exercise, it's gonna get your blood flowing, it's gonna get your heart rate going, and it's gonna, like I said, it's gonna help your all around mood. So exercise is a great way to become happier. Also, sleeping more. This is something that <laughs> I struggle with because um, I know ever since I started doing the blog, um, if I have a vlog to do the next day, it's hard for me to sleep because I'm excited and I want to, uh, you know, talk about things that are going to help you guys, that kind of thing. But sleeping more will actually improve your mood as well. It will uh, stop the negative thoughts. So getting enough sleep is very important, guys, to being happy. Also, spending more time with family and friends. Um, we're so busy in our daily lives running after money and, uh, you know, we're trying to uh, get the, the best house and all these other material things that we're trying to achieve in our lives. Spending more time with family and friends helps keep you grounded. Um, it helps keep you focused on what's important and that's people, relationships with people. So that's a great way to become happier, just spending more time with family and friends. And that's something that I, I need to do more as well. Um, getting outside more. The sun. I, I always talk about this. The sun is like life for me. Being in, having the breeze blowing on my face, that kind of thing, it's like life for me. And the sun is really good for your brain. So, getting outside more is great for happiness. Also, helping others. I will tell you, and I, I've said this in some previous blogs, doing, getting up and knowing that I'm going to do this with you guys on the days that I'm going to do it, it just, it does something to me. I just feel like this is what I'm supposed to be doing in my life. And it took me to get to this age to really like get into it, to really like say, okay, this is what I'm really supposed to do. And it just, it feeds me when I'm helping somebody else because it also helps me. So guys, helping other people is great for uh, helping you to be happy as well. Practice smiling. <laughs> I have heard this and heard this over the years. Just smiling helps you, helps improve your mood as well because it's moving those muscles, it reduces pain, it improves, like I said, your mood and it helps you think better also when you're smiling. So that's something that you guys need to practice as well. Um, planning a trip. This is something I know a lot of us, because of our, our lives, we don't get to take vacations, we don't get to go on trips, that kind of thing. Um, 
planning a trip, even if you're not able to take the trip right away, just the planning of it, knowing that someday this is going to happen for you. Just plan a trip um, to anywhere that you want to go in the world or even the country. Just plan a trip and that will make you happier because it's something that you will have to look forward to. That's why it will make you happy. Um, meditating. Getting quiet with yourself and your thoughts and the things the things that you want to do in your life and, and, and the, the things that you want to accomplish, the things that you want to do for other people, the things that you want to do for yourself, just meditating and concentrating on what life really means to you and where you're trying to go with your life. So try to meditate, guys. I, I would say that's something that you should probably try to do every single day. If you're not able to do it for an hour, maybe a half an hour, I would say even 15 minutes a day. If, if you can start out like that, that would be great for you guys. Um, moving closer to work. I will tell you, since I've been working from home, this has been great. Sometimes I, I will say, tell you that it keeps me in the house more, so, and that can be a little tough sometimes. But moving closer to your job, because it will cut down on your commute, so you will be able to spend more time with your family, your friends, that kind of thing. You're not always um, working or trying to get to work or coming home from work. So. Um, if that's something that you guys can accomplish, that would be great for you as well. And that would help you become more more happy as well. Um, my favorite is practicing gratitude. Being grateful and thankful for the things that you have in your life will definitely make you happier. Just being grateful for waking up in the morning. Being grateful for the home that you live in. Being grateful for having a home to live in because there's a lot of people who are homeless today. Um, being grateful for having, having life. Being grateful for, uh, you know, if, if you're able to walk, being grateful for things like that because it could be different because there are a lot of people who are living and not able to walk. So just being grateful for little things, your children, um, being grateful for having a mind that is clear, that you can think, uh, being grateful for uh, just, just for you, <laughs> just being grateful for you being you. Those kind of things will make you happier. And another thing that I'm finding as I get older, getting older makes you happier because you get to the place in your life where you're not even concerned about what people think about you. You're not concerned about what people are saying about you. You're not concerned about what people uh you know, you're not concerned about things that, like when I was 20, I was concerned about how I looked, um, I was concerned about if people liked me, I was concerned about if people were talking about me, these kind of things, I don't, I can care less today. And this is what I want you got. No, don't be, don't concentrate on what people think of you because it doesn't matter whether you're doing everything right, you're still gonna have people who don't agree, who don't like you, who don't, uh, uh, they're not gonna be supportive of you or anything like that. So forget the crap, forget, I call it crap. <laughs> These are things that we have to deal with in our lives, but it's the way you deal with it. Not being concerned about what people are thinking about you will help you become happier. So today, guys, 
that's my thought. Those are my thoughts for you today. Um, I really want you guys to get this message about happiness because, um, like I've said in some previous vlogs, we're only here for a short period of time. And being happy is, I mean, when you get to your last day, one thing you really want to be able to say is that I lived my life to the fullest and I was happy doing it. And it doesn't have anything to do with how many material things that you have. There are people who have all kinds of material things and they're committing suicide and things like that. So it really, material things and money and things like that don't make you happy. You have to be happy with the person that you are. And you have to work at being happy. It's not something that just happens to us. It's something that we were when we were born because we didn't know any better. Life teaches us things. And when, we, when we're going through life, uh, there are a lot of things in our world that can make us unhappy. So you have to practice being happy. And you have to actively get, in, get involved in your happiness. It's your responsibility to yourself to work at being happy. So again, guys, that's, that's, those are my thoughts for you today. Um, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. I do have a lot more stuff that I want to um, talk to you guys about. And um, thank you so much for watching the videos. And again, always, always love yourself. Have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you guys on the other side. Thank you so much. Bye.